in the wild west of Outlaws of Thunder Junction. Mercenaries, rogues and plants are fighting for you in the command zone. With lots of spiky friends, Grizzly might bring Mono Green back to Duel Commander. So let's have another episode of Bitzel Bruce. Our new friend does not only grow bigger personally, he can also grow his entire crew if you can manage to bring down some lands every now and then. The activated ability is a great mana sink while also threatening to end games quickly. Although we haven't found them yet, there might be some combos with Cryptic Trilobite, Walking Ballista and the like. But without further ado, let's have a look at some cards. Grizzly's design offers for two variants of this deck. We can either go wide by leaning into a land synergy and spells that ramp you up quickly, or we take a more aggressive approach and use our cactus to develop big threats that beat down our opponent. For this brew, we're focusing on the latter variant. Mana dogs are very welcome in this deck. They help us casting Grizzly early, can be targets for our plus one plus one counters and finally help us with activating the doubling ability. Springbloom Druid and the like help us leaning more into the landfall ability and ramping our way to bigger spells. A bit of a special spot is occupied by Awake in the Woods, which is not ramp in the classic sense. It is this deck's discount for Erlingers when the commander is on the board and let's be honest, if you get the chance to create Dried Orbers in any deck, you go for it. After a few landfall triggers, our cactus is already in a wild shape, so we want to make sure to protect Grizzly and other threats from interaction. Along with Legolas Quick Reflexes, we can also include a card that has been sitting on a bench for quite some time, Heroic Intervention. Depending on the metagame, there are even more options, but for now, let's leave it at that. The most interesting part of this deck is the variety of synergistic spells we can finally put together in one deck. From Ocelifs to Hardened Scales that support the counter aspect of the deck, we also have Soul Cauldron or Kodama of the West Tree that also support the counter aspect. Basically that's what most of the cards do. Since green is not too strong in terms of interaction, we've also packed a few fight spells to deal with nasty threats your opponents might bring up. And if that's still not enough, you just play Brizzly in the 99 in any aggressive deck you can find. Whatever you do, don't touch the cactus. Cheers.